Hi, I'm Brittany from AndroidPit.com. Anyone who considers themselves a true Android fan has three dates marked on their calendar. CES, the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, IFA in Berlin, and the MWC in Barcelona. It's the latter event which we're interested in today. What announcements can we expect and what are we looking forward to? What is the MWC? It's one of the largest high-tech conferences in the world and it takes place every year in February in Barcelona. It's entirely dedicated to the mobile phone industry. Now let's talk about Samsung. Will we see the Galaxy S8 or not? That's the big question. Some people think we will see an unveiling in Barcelona and others think the big reveal will happen later in April. In short, it's just a lot of unconfirmed rumors. According to some rumors, it will be released in two versions, a classic and an edge format. It's rumored to have a bezel-less display design, fingerprint scanner built into the screen, and a new Exynos 8995 or Snapdragon 835, depending on the market. It will also have an AI assistant called Bixby, Android Nougat, and no headphone jack. LG has already sent out early press invitations for their event on February 26th, where we will most likely see the unveiling of the LG G6. LG has confirmed the device will not be modular and it's rumored to be keeping the headphone jack. It will have a 5.3 inch display and ship with Android Nougat. LG may also reveal some mid-range smartphones at MWC this year. Last year, LG presented the X-Cam and the X-Screen. Motorola is having their press conference on February 26th as well. There's talk that we will see the Moto G5 Plus. Those waiting for a successor to the Moto Z will be disappointed. The G5 Plus will have a 5.5 inch full HD display, a Snapdragon 625 processor, and Android Nougat. Will we see the Xiaomi Mi 6 at MWC? It's very likely. Nothing has been announced, but last year Xiaomi took advantage of the opportunity to launch the Mi 5 at MWC. It may launch with three variants. With different levels of processing power, the cheapest will have a MediaTek Helio X30, and the other two will have a Snapdragon 835 processor. The camera looks better than that of the Pixel based on the materials, and the device will have a 4000 mAh battery. The Sony press conference will happen on the 27th of February at 8.30 a.m. The Japanese manufacturer has a habit of releasing a new smartphone every six months. Two are currently being talked about the G3112 and the G2121. Pictures of Sony Xperia XA have also been leaked. Nokia's presentation is confirmed for the 26th of February. The brand is making its comeback. Nokia has teased on its social networks that smartphones will be announced. We have no details at the moment, but we're certain to see the brand at MWC. Maybe we will get a US release of the China-only Nokia 6. Officially, there's no press conference scheduled for HTC at MWC this year, but numerous rumors lead us to think that HTC may present some smartphones at MWC. HTC is planning six to seven new smartphones for 2017. Of these, two have already been released, the HTC U Ultra and HTC U Play, both featuring the Sense Companion AI. Could we possibly see the successor to the HTC 10? In the afternoon of February 26th, Huawei will have its press event. We may see the Huawei P10 at MWC, but it's not likely based on last year's release schedule. It's more likely to see a release between May and June of this year. It will be powered by a Kirin 960 processor, have a 5.5 inch screen, and ship with Android Nougat, just like the Mate 9. There is a rumor that Apple could make an appearance at MWC this year. Traditionally, the manufacturer doesn't attend, but Apple made a surprise appearance on the list of manufacturers presenting at the expo. However, their name on the list has disappeared quickly, so we can't know for sure either way. And what about the other manufacturers? ZTE, BlackBerry TCL, and other brands will be at MWC presenting as well. And that's a wrap for our pre-MWC rumor roundup. For more videos, check out our YouTube channel. And for more news, check out AndroidPit.com.